Good afternoon, YouTube. Akira2805 here. Back again with another exciting Yu-Gi-Oh! deck review. Um, today I'm going to be doing something a little different that I've never tried before. Um, this is going to be nothing more than a, a deck update. You know, get you, uh, get you assured that I'm keeping up with the tournament ruling and everything, the ban list and all that good stuff, etc., etc. Um, these three decks are the main ones that I've and I've really messed with since the last time I did a deck review on them. Uh, they've gotten several hundred reviews on them. Uh, they've done very well in the dueling world. And I just want to show you all that I've updated them. So I'm going to be doing a, a triple deck review today, an updated deck review. I have a Pandora's Box, which is my um, uh, malefic uh, skill drain deck. Uh, De La Mer is the uh, the water deck, uh, Aqua Sea Serpent and uh, uh, fish type deck, and this right here is my Machina deck, my uh, Machina Cyber Dragon and uh, uh, Gadget deck. That's uh, IOD stands for Instruments of Destruction. So let's start off with the Pandora's Box, the Malefic Skill Drain deck. All right, let me get the camera repositioned here. Give me one good second. There we go. Zoom in so you all can see it perfectly. All right. Pandora's Box, here we go. Three Cyber End Dragons. One Stardust Dragon, and that's it for the extra deck. I'm no longer uh, proxying uh, the Rainbow Dragon for the. Uh, oh, excuse me, I was uh, proxying the Red Eyes Black Dragon for the Rainbow Dragon. No, not anymore. I finally got him. I finally said, hey, why, am, why haven't I ordered this guy? He's not that expensive these days. <laughs> Dumbass. Anyway, one Rainbow Dragon, Gores of the Emissary of Darkness. Uh, extremely good in this deck, considering it's slow as Serp. <laughs> so if my opponent ever takes out my field spell and my uh, Malefic cards and my back row, uh, I got this guy for backup. Hopefully it doesn't hit me uh, extremely too hard. <laughs> you know. Anyway. <laughs> uh, extremely good for backup. Three blue eyes white dragons. Now I have three of these bad boys, the Beast King of Barbaros. One dual mode beast dragon. Three Malefic Cybers. One Malefic Rainbow Dragon, of course. Uh, the Malefic Stardust Dragon, three Malefic Blue Eyes, and two Malefic Truth Dragons. Okay, on the spells, one uh, Terraforming, three Necro Valleys, two Mystic Plasma Zones, since all my monsters are dark anyway, so they give us an extra oomph in their attack. Three uh, Malefic Worlds. Again, another card for backup in case my field's ever wiped out. Uh, scapegoat is extremely good. Give me alive a little longer. One Power Filter. This card has messed up so many people. <laughs> it has really pissed them off. I have screwed up uh, frog decks. I have uh, screwed up uh, a couple of uh, um, fable decks. What else have I messed up? Hmm. You don't come to mind right now, but those two decks, uh, this one card is really messed up. Especially a frog deck, since all of them are 1,000 less below anyway. So, anyway, moving on. Uh, one dark hole. Hold on to the traps. Three skill drains. Two traps done. Okay, stop pushing it over now. 
three dark bribes, extremely useful. Two eradicator epidemic virus from the new structure deck um, uh, gates of the underworld and one deck devastation virus waiting a long time for these three cars to come in come in for us well we've had them before but they were much more uh, rare and more expensive trying to get them so especially with a malefic deck these cards come in mighty handy uh, especially when uh, my opponent's about to take out my field spell, which destroys my uh, my left X, I play one of these. And you all know what they do. I have a bit of a revenge uh, to pay for that. <laughs> they want to destroy my malefic monsters? Go right ahead. You're going to suffer uh, one of these three cards. <laughs> anyway. Okay, that is the uh, Malefic Skill Drain deck part of this video. Moving on to the, uh, the water deck. Uh, De La Mia, I'm sorry. Water slash wind deck. Alright. I uh, hope these are organized. And yes, they are. Thank God. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, we have one... Uh, I can pronounce the name right now. The Sea Dragon, Leviar. Levier. There we go. One Submersible Carrier Aereo Shark. And now three Leviathan Dragons, number 17. Alright, the regular monsters. Two Sky Star Rays. Three Fly Fangs. Three air orcas, three drill barnacles, one penguin soldier, one lost blue breaker, three winged tortoises, one big jaws for now. I'm trying to get another one, one snowman eater, uh, ocean's keeper. And that's it for the monsters. Okay, well, we went through that kind of fast, didn't we? On to spells. Three surfaces. One swords revealing light. Water hazard. This card comes in handy, like, in the early stage of the duel, but uh, later on, it's kind of hard to play, because uh, my field's usually full by, like, maybe the five or sixth turn, so... Uh, this card is in question. One hammer shot. One MST. Pot of duality. Three aqua jets. One Yumi. And that's it for the spells. Moving on to traps. Three O oh fish. Two gravity bind, one mirror force, two threatening roars, and two underworld egg clutch. All right, moving on to the final deck review of this video. It is the Machina deck, which is my top deck uh, that I take in, take in uh, the tournaments. This is the deck I use, because it is my fastest and strongest deck I own. And I like it. Uh, it um, I like machine decks. One of my favorites. Uh, one Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon. Two over dragons and that's it. The deck doesn't really uh, revolve around them a lot. They're just there for temporary backup I guess. Okay, one Machina Force, three Machina Fortresses, three Gear Frames, I'll just say their name, 
two peacekeepers, three cyber dragons, of course, to help out with the uh, oh, the fusions. Excuse me. Uh, cyber dragons away. I have one of those. Two Jinzos. Two Jinzo uh, returner. One red, green, and yellow gadget. That's it for the monster arsenal. On to spells. One uh, for Ben Chalice. Book of Moon. Monster Reborn. Two. MSTs, Overload Fusion, two Smashing Ground, Heavy Storm, and Future Fusion, and okay, not and, <laughs> uh, Limiter Removal, and a Dark Hole. <sighs> okay, on the traps, you have a Solemn Judgment. Three compulsory evacuation devices. These cards have come in extremely handy through the years I've uh, played this deck. Two bottomless trap holes and two dimensional prisons. All right, and that's it for my uh, three deck updates. Let me zoom out, get everything back to where it was before. That's off, isn't it? And there you have it, folks. Hope you all enjoyed this uh, long review. It's almost working on uh, 12 minutes now. Uh, do like it. Do rate, comment, uh, tell your friends about it. Uh, do anything you can. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm just recovering over a slight cold. <coughs> okay, well, hope you all enjoyed it. And until next time, this is Akira2805. Signing off, and thanks for watching.